if you've ever looked at a presentation where um, someone someone will show a pie chart and within that pie chart there's a section called other and that other section is then broken out into another pie chart that's called a pie of pie and Excel lets you do that fairly easily as well as let you customize it to to do a lot of cool things with it so um, to give you an example let's say we have these sales data from various countries that we sell product to and let's say we create a traditional pie chart and we see that there's three or four slivers here that are just really small and it's going to be really hard to you know do a presentation where that looks nice and where we can explain away what those little slivers are what we'd want to do in this case probably is lump these together and make them an other section and then break it out into smaller detail and I will show you how to do that now so if we highlight the data the same as we would for a traditional pie and go to an insert pie chart we find this graphic here that's called pie of pie and let's click that and we'll move the data labels into the pie chart so it makes more sense of what we're looking at So what you'll see here is that if we go to Format Data Series, Excel automatically grabs the last three or four smallest sections and automatically kicks them into another section and makes a new pie. And that's what it means by position. It's position within your original data set. And that's why we always like to put our data in descending order. Of values and that's why you saw my sales data in descending order so this is pretty interesting if you want to say Mexico is big enough to warrant its own place on the first graph you can simply kick it down to three and then other will only include the three countries here now that's really interesting if the only um, facet of the graph that you want kicked over into another section is simply the smallest sections however there may be an instance if we see within this sales data we may want all Southeast Asian sales to be in the other section and we do that by going to the same menu format data series and instead of clicking per position we go down to custom and this enables us to pick any one of these data points and kick it to whatever pie we want it in. So Thailand is also a Southeast Asian nation. So we'll click on Thailand. Sorry I did that wrong here. So we'll right click format data series. We we'll go to custom. We click on the pie, piece of the pie that represents Thailand. It's per, presently in pr first plot. We want it in the second plot. And now we have an other section that is all the Southeast Asian sales. If we want to clean it up even a little bit more we can change this other to whatever we want and we can make it more clear that this other pie is Southeast Asian countries we can also get rid of this to clean it up a little bit and there you have a nice pie of pie with uh, a variation on how you can set these up hope this helps thanks for watching